Thank you, Council President and Council. First off, I applaud the City Council for having the foresight to take another look at the project. As business manager of Steamfitters Local 475 and vice president of the Union County Building Trades, I'm a strong supporter of this project, not only because it will provide much needed jobs in the most difficult economic time our country has experienced since the Depression, but because there are safeguards in place through the permitting process that will ensure the coal gasification technology being considered is based on sound and prudent science. There's not one building tradesman who wants to build a plant that's not safe. In the not too distant past, many of our members worked in places where there were not environmental safeguards in place and our men died prematurely of a variety of different causes. Today, we have the capability to engineer and build these plants so they're able to conform to the health and safety standards that are well above and beyond the projects that, will be, that were built in the past. And I will let the experts prove that, not a bunch of environmental extremists who you're hearing from tonight. When completed, this will be one of the safest and state-of-the-art power production facilities in the world. Our men know how to build heavy industrial plants. Our members are some of the most productive and safest craftsmen on the planet. Coal plants are nothing new in the United States and are certainly nothing new in New Jersey. There's currently over 1,483 coal-fired plants in the United States, nine of which are here in New Jersey. There's one thing that each and every one of these plants does that this plant doesn't do. This plant will not burn coal. That needs to be reinforced. The environmentalists are referencing the coal burn that's going on. It's not going to be burning any coal. It will pressurize coal to 3,000 uh, pounds per square inch and liquefy the CO2 where it will be permanently buried beneath the ocean floor. No burning of fossil fuels takes place. There's three reasons why I like this memorandum of understanding. I, uh, the subcommittee, I applaud what you've done. Number one, the revenue that will now be available to Linden because of the further negotiations that took place is all the more reason to support the project. This is only the beginning of what will be a terrific source of tax income for Linden. Now, I referenced it the last time I spoke here. We've, we're going through about 30 to 40 percent of our men being out of work. 30 to 40 percent of our men are having trouble paying their bills, paying their mortgages, putting food on the table. Many of them work in Linden. Many of them live in Linden. The last time I came here, I listened to some of the council members very intently. I heard one town council member reference that crime was going up in his ward. That's a result of a poor economy. In addition, the city of Linden had to, I heard another councilman mention that he's furloughing some city workers. Again, General Motors has closed. Countless plants in Linden have closed. This is a source of revenue for the city that cannot be ignored. The fact that an independent scientific expert who will be selected by Linden and advising Linden on exactly how this technology will work is another step in ensuring that all the safeguards will be in place. There's also my third reason that I like this better, this memorandum of understanding. There's an opportunity for a project labor agreement now being in place, ensuring that when the job is built, fair wages, fair benefit packages, and no work stoppages will not interfere with the progress and success of the project. I reference the environmentalist. I have nothing personal against these people, but I do believe that they are re referencing facts and figures that are pointedly intended to scare the public. They don't work here. They don't live here. They are extremist groups that do not represent the mainstream scientific community. And I'm asking the town council to support this project and keep that in mind. Thank you for your time. <laughs>